is Rachel with Piper, and today we're going to do an introduction to down. Uh, down is another one of those basic commands. It's a good one for her to know. It's uh, kind of one of the building blocks of her training. You can practice stays and weights with that. I know that we've already gone over weight, and she's uh, picking up on it really well. And she's good at sit, especially when it's just one on one. She doesn't have any other distractions, and they have these treats that she really enjoys. So down is going to be our next step. Now, to do this, I'm going to uh, kneel down so I'm closer on her level. Have her sit first because that is easier um, for dogs while they're learning. And then I'm going to use the treat, bring it to the center of her chest so her head goes down, and then bait her outwards with the treat. I'm also going to hang on to the leash and give her a little bit of pressure pulling down on the leash to help encourage her to lay down. So, hi, Alright, sit. Good, sit. Piper. Down. 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 Piper, 
adjust her front legs to kind of balance herself so she gets more steady when you want to ease her into it down. Now, try a little bit more, but one thing you can do to help her start understanding the word is by rewarding her by catching her in the act. As you remember the previous videos when we praise her, so like when I tell her to sit, and I praise her for the sit. I tell her, good sit, good sit, Piper, so that she hears it again and she, it helps um, her to associate the word with the action. So, if you're around the house and you see her lying down on her own, but she's still over, you, it, grab a treat sneakily so she doesn't get up and go down and give her the treat and tell her, good down. That will help her start to um, associate that action with the word down. Piper, sit, sit, down, down, good girl, now let her chew on the tree, down,
we don't want to get her too tired uh, with doing the trainings. It should always be fun, so it's good to work in short, um, you know, 10, 15 minutes tops with her and do it frequently. So for that last one, what worked is I had the treat in my hand and I was holding the leash with that hand. Now, I was just giving gentle pressure on the leash. She doesn't do well if you tug too much, then she wants to get up. But just a slight gentle pressure, and then I use my left hand to tap her left foot and get her down. And that worked out well. She did a very good job, and she uh, didn't get too frustrated. She was still trying the entire time, trying to understand what I wanted. So that's really good to see. I'll work on this at home, and I'm sure she's just going to get better and better. And don't forget, if you do see her lying down around the house, give her a treat and tell her to go down to reward her in the act of doing it. And uh, make sure that she's still laying down by the time you give her that treat. I know a lot of times dogs jump up when they see you uh, coming to them, but make sure she stays down and don't give her the treat unless she is in a down. Hope this helps. This was Rachel and Piper. We are working on down.